my name's Eli Percy and I'm going to read a short story called A Good Person. You go across the Normandy. She buys you a beer and herself an iron brew. She tells you her name is Leslie. Leslie the lesbian. Imagine what my high school life was like. Were you out? Sort of. Half the lasses in your hockey team were bent. I don't understand. Did you or didn't you get called Leslie the lesbian? <laughs> Never mind. You don't know what else to say. She asks why you were at Hadley's. You tell her Bobby borrowed money to pay for your ma's funeral because that's what Bobby told you to say if you were stopped by the police or anyone. She goes quiet, squeezes your hand. You feel shite lying to her, but you can't tell her the real reason. Anyway, you like her touching you and you don't want her to stop. She says she's sorry for your loss and asks if you want to talk about it. You don't, but no for the reason she thinks. Because what can you say about a ma that hated you their whole life and thought you were an embarrassment? You wouldn't even have bothered with the funeral if not for Bobby. Half a beer later, you need to piss. Decide to use a disabled. There's a guy sitting in the bar. He's somebody's dad you went to school with. And you're way at the toilet, he says, Well done, mate. She's stunning. Aye. So, uh, you're a boy the lassie, me and Wally here. He points at the barman. Been trying to work it out. No. You walk away. That's not an answer, he shouts. Mom, tell us if you get a hot dog or a bun. Sorry, says Leslie. Want to go someplace else? Where? This town's a fucking hole. She squeezes your hands again. Tell me about yourself, she says. Where'd you stay? Where'd you work? Edinburgh. Close enough to visit Bobby, but far enough away that you can't bring bullshit to my door. Her eyes go wide. You grin. I love my brother, but he does some crazy shit. Thank you.